all in all, we're um, the River Lee, or Navigation Canal Lee, and bygone years, every lock had a lock keeper, and every lock keeper had a house. These were built oh, well over a hundred years ago. Basically, all the houses have now been demolished. And very, very few are left. As you can see, this house over here. And to get here by car, you literally have to drive down towpath. And the towpath is directly in front of me. As a kid, I always dreamt of having a place like this. And the first time I see a place like this was on an old science fiction film called First Men in the Moon. I absolutely love that little film. But then back there's a cottage. This is a house. Sometimes they'll have a plaque on them to tell you how old the house is. This one doesn't. This is like a very large lock. And as you can see, there's a lot of concrete being used in its construction. It looks more like a World War II German fortification than a lock. And uh, there's way too much sun in front of me. And just put my hands over the cover and no, I can't see any visible plaque. But okay, we're around about the 1860s, 1870s. As I say, it's over 100 years ago. What do you think about this dugout? Mostly by hand, very basic, rudimentary tools, machines, backbreaking work as you can imagine. These go on for hundreds, hundreds of miles. They're probably actually taking thousands of square miles. That's the path that little car to drive down to get here. So, we've not been this way for such a long time. And the last thing I need to, right now is go down some blasted stairs. But then again, oh, there we go, dear, oh dear. They got enough stairs in there, have they? I can't hold on to the rail, because the rail's covered in stinging nettles. Oh, oh, I've had a creedy. A few more to go. We're getting there, we're getting there, we're getting there. Oh. Oh. I don't know what I feel. I don't know what a crab feels like now. This has all been renewed. So, it doesn't take a lot of intelligence to work out. This little bridge is used constantly for it to actually be rebuilt. An environment agency, rod license required to fish this water. Okay, fine. Uh, that's got to be on the wrong side because this side is where the lakes are. That side is where the canal is. Because we've not been over it for a few years, Vinny's never been this part of the Lee Valley before. And I honestly and truthfully don't know which way to go. And of course, the first obstacle we come to is a left and a turn. Now, Max, are you sure we're going that way? All right. Well, Max, we're actually going around this way. No, no, no. Out, out. You're not, definitely, you're not going in there. Come on, Max. Vinny. What are you doing down there? Yeah, you. So, I'm not too sure. Max thinks it's this way. Well, like me, Max has got a fantastic memory. Where he gets it wrong, it's just one of those things, I suppose. We've got all day. No bad rush. Oh no, more steps. Oh dear. Oh, these are more manageable. These are more sensible steps. You get like steps of like sort of eight inch drop. And it's like, oh, really, really taxes on your legs. You can see it's a well done path. And I'm not sure where this goes. Uh, remember we turn right. At that, at that big sort of T junction. Now we're going to stay on this path and hopefully it takes where we want to go and that'll be at the back of Ashley's Lake. 
I do believe Ashley's Lake is now on the left hand side but we have to go all the way around the lake to get to the other side yeah all right all right all right, all right. I'm coming I'm coming Whew, come on little fella you can see someone's been through here it's either a moped or a wheelbarrow and a wheelbarrow is for people to go fishing and like I say I'm not sure if we're actually going the right way that all will be revealed as they say this all's in mushrooms oh all my years I don't see mushrooms that big before obviously wow look at that looks like a little science fiction city doesn't it oh, you know sit there Sort of a different planet somewhere, you know, all people living near them, bits and pieces, it's like, whoa. Yeah, they're big old things, aren't they? <sighs> Lots of people pick wild mushrooms, and believe you me, if you do your research, even so-called experts that eat the wrong stuff, and it can kill you. Mushrooms, shuts down your organs, no cure, he absolutely cream cracker as they say if you want mushrooms buy them from a shop and my legs are getting stunk to pieces this is what I don't miss about the summer well spring still really I've got another month to go yet before we officially summer in the UK that's the 20th of June although people will say oh blasting hot summer uh, no, it's, we're still in spring. And people just get excited today. They get a bit of rain. Country comes to a standstill. Yeah, you know where it is. I don't think that is Ashley's Lake over there. I don't know if you can see that. I don't think that is Ashley's Lake. I think that's another lake. And I've got a funny feeling we're going the wrong way. Uh, a lot of mud through here, as you can see. We keep going, it's got to come out somewhere, but where, oh, I'm not too sure. Worst comes to the worst, we can double back, can't we? We'll go a bit further, see what we can see. If not, we'll simply turn around and go back the other way. Had no rain for over a week. So when it was raining, you can imagine how bad it was through here. And luckily for me, I've got my sandals on, but I've also got my um, shorts on. It's all the stinging nettles. They're all going to go loopy-loo. Ah, oh dear. All right, keep going. Keep way up a daisy. We keep going and see where we where we end up. It's bound to be a part one or a part two or whatever. Uh, point was going down there, that's just gonna take you to the lake. Uh, we'll stay, stay on the beaten track as they were. Right, that'll do for part one guys, I think. Bye-bye. <laughs>